All right, another article you wrote. Three under the radar uh, potential roster cuts the Browns should keep an eye on and target. Uh, number three, uh, Clavon Kaysen, linebacker for the Jaguars. Number two, Trey Sermon, uh, running back for the Eagles. And Neville Gallimore, defensive tackle um, for the Cowboys. Tell me what you like about those. Which ones you think uh, could end up potentially with the Browns if they get cut? I like out of those three, I think I like Gallimore the best just because I'm still not 100% sold on the defensive tackle uh, depth. I know they have another former Cowboy, Tristan Hill, who's got a lot of talent but has had issues off the field. Maurice Hurst, is, uh, he's got probably he's probably the most talented outside of Dalvin Tomlinson, but the health has been an issue. And then you get Jordan Elliott, Tommy Togiai, um, you know, those guys I'm not 100% sold on. Togi, I'm not so sure he's even going to make the roster. And then Gallimore's over there in Dallas where they've kind of gotten a little more depth with Jonathan Hankins and Maisie Smith. So I could see him being somebody that ends up out there on the waiver wire. And I just think that he would be an upgrade as a uh, backup to, to Tomlinson. Um, kind of has a, a little bit of pass rushing ability, but is a little bit better against the run. Um, Trey Sermon, I've just, you know, going back to watching him at Ohio State, I really just always liked him. I like his running style. Uh, Cleveland doesn't have a lot of depth behind Nick Chubb and um, Jerome Ford, so I wouldn't be opposed at all to seeing somebody like Trey Sermon in there fighting for the for the third role. And uh, Kalevon Chasen is a uh, former first-round pick. I like, you know, the linebacking core isn't terrible in Cleveland, but to having a guy that's able to kind of play in that linebacker but also – come in and blitz off the edge is in my opinion never a bad thing he hasn't made lived up to his draft pick status so he's somebody that if i saw him hit the open wire uh i'd be interested in seeing what he had in the tank